Hello, Yahweh to Hell, which is the name I chose about 10 years ago when I started making videos on YouTube. It was a bit of a pun on words. Highway to Hell is a really good song by a group I like. So, it, today I probably wouldn't have used that name as my username, but it's done now. So, anyway. I wanted to keep addressing Daro um, in this particular video. I want to give him a little bit of a hand because he seems to be pretty passionate and diligent about um, spreading this good news of the kingdom and um, and wanting to help people. Like the, the most part of his videos are about sort of explaining scripture interpreting them in in the way that uh, he thinks should be and I think he's quite good at what he does in terms of that I think he's I, I know he's not um, a half like an idiot I know he's he seems fairly intelligent so I give him credit for that but when it comes to his um you know name calling and being horrible and cruel to, to ex-members of Jehovah's Witnesses it shows that obviously most Jehovah's Witnesses feel they have the right to treat ex-Jehovah's Witnesses as as just nothing. Like they have the right to call them all sorts of names. Like uh, yeah, for instance, in one of his last videos, he refers to um, to many of us as slobs and unkempt, and uh, he refers to myself as as um, as these things and uh, even a homosexual which I don't consider derogatory anyway and uh, transgender <laughs> I could be transgender I don't know how but anyway that's that's a sort of mentality he has and his videos are so much less effective because of that what you what you do with your videos by explaining scriptures in, in your own words is is pretty productive I think but then you go and do these other things which are completely counterproductive if I was somebody that was interested in finding out a little bit more about the Jehovah's Witnesses or was a former member that just fallen away or just anyone out of interest as a person that's studying and, and, and they come across your videos you know <laughs> You know, I don't think I don't think you're going to be as effective as what you would be if if you just stuck to what you know. What you don't know is whether I'm a, a former Jehovah's Witness that was um, baptized or, or whatever. You just see me as somebody that's against what you're doing as an apostate. Um, and it, look, I'm trying to help you here, dude, because. I just think that uh, if you if you could sort of simmer down on that a little bit, um, you, you'd be better off. But what what you're doing is you're actually showing up um, Jehovah's Witnesses as something they're not. Well, something they're not at your door anyway. Let's put it that way. When you're at my door witnessing to me, let's say for instance, I guarantee you wouldn't refer to me as any of those things. But behind the monitor. You become a keyboard warrior and this this aggressive YouTube poster which is just do you not see that whatever effect you're trying to have on people it's not working it, it can't work it simply can't work unless what you're doing is you you're doing your videos to get at apostates or people that um, don't necessarily agree with your religion when I showed my dad, when I showed my dad the video that you did fairly recently and you called me a, a, a homosexual and a transgender or whatever, and my dad was disgusted. He wants to find out more about you and whatever. He's struggled for years to try to get me to go to a memorial. And I've got to say, over the past couple of years, he has softened my, my heart a little bit towards Jehovah's Witnesses. I know a lot of them, a lot of his friends, and I consider them all to be really decent people. But then again, that's to my face. It's very hypocritical because I, I, I know that 
that if you were out on the doors and you knocked on my door, you might see me as disheveled and unkempt and whatever else. By the way, I have struggled. Yeah, I've been homeless. Now I'm in a home. I have showers. I have a washing, uh, washing machine, dryer. And although I might look this way, it's not necessarily because I have to. I, I just like it. That's just my, my choice. So, and, and your choice is to be you and do what you do and dress the way you dress and, and, and whatever else. And if, if, if I wanted to, man, I could be really piss weak as well and and uh, say so many things about you that, that would piss you off. But I'm not going there, man. There's no point. I just think that, especially in, in your case where you're proactive and you're out there as one of only, one and only Jehovah's Witness out there doing what you do, I would have thought that, um, but you'd be a little bit more understanding and uh, just sort of see things without such judgmental eyes. Um, anyway, that's just a little hint for you, man, handy hint. Just uh, if, if you want your videos to, to sort of get out there, a little less on the judgmental side. I'm not an apostate. I hate that word. So you, you're confused already by referring to me as, as all these things um i like you man i think your video is pretty good um other than this thing that shows you up as being the weak otherwise you come across quite intelligent i love you and i'm not gay not that i, I could be you're a pretty good looking guy <laughs>